and congratulations to Lao SD's team. Um, it's so great to have our partner in the city hall, Mr. Council Ken Lit Lee. So thank you for coming up here to support our community. Thank you all.
now, mommy, and guess what? You're right. Fried grasshoppers do taste like potato chips. Joe? Lately, that was given to me last year by my Lolo. Lolo meaning grandpa in Tagalog. The first song I will be singing is called Feelings. Okay. I hope you can hear my ukulele, guys. Okay. Oh, I've been catching feelings, staring at the ceiling, thinking about the good times, but time's already passed by. I hope you don't notice that my heart is broken. All I think about now is how I will be coping. Da -da. She's a stare up at the ceiling Thought about the good times When time had already passed by I hope that you notice I'm no longer broken I have found a good guy to call my I wrote this song So you can smile Let's give another round of applause for Syrah All right uh, next, I want to introduce, introduce you to uh, this year LCC Miss Lao New Year pageant with Jocelyn Grace and runner up Jada Wan Ping. Now, Vanessa, second runner up, Vanessa Keldara. She was here earlier, but she had to leave, so it's going to be uh, just Jocelyn and Jada today. Hi everyone again. <laughs> um, so I'm Jesslyn. I was crowned Miss Lao San Diego 2024. Hello everyone. My name is Jada Onping and I was crowned as first princess and runner up. So Jada, how was your experience just being a part of the pageant and going to the weekly practices? Thank you. Honestly, the, the practices and just being in the beauty pageant, I felt very involved in my culture and the practices every Sunday were just for a few hours and there was a lot of aunties and uncles that I've met and they're very supportive. Very so nice. if you're hesitant about joining the beauty pageant, just go for it because it's not just about beauty. We learned a lot about self-confidence and building our public speaking skills. Special thanks to Auntie Bobby. She gave us a little workshop on that. Um, and so again, if you're hesitant about joining you should because uh, we had a great time. I got to make a friend. <laughs> yeah, we made a lot of friends actually. And where I'm from, um, I don't really know that many young Laotian women that are around my age. So um, that was something that I found to be really valuable from just being a part of the Thank pageant. you, Jocelyn and Jada. Thank you for participating in the Loud New Year pageant. Thank you for encouraging our youngster to uh, continue to participate. <laughs> How much I was telling her, her <laughs> ancestors telling her, she's not even measuring. No measurement. In Lao, we call ga ao, ga ao. Ga ao, ga ao. Say to the ga ao. Big one, say to the ao, say sam buang, sa. She said, say sam ni. Say sam ni, duh. And sis Lao Pong, they say, Oh, sab sab, 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 one, two, three. No! Go, 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 go! No water! No water! You have to wait five minutes. Oh no! Okay, you have to wait five minutes. All right. What what time are we on? Ah, Tito Loki, my pet has zip no to call. Wow! Oh my goodness, guys! We got a big crowd. Make some noise! Make some noise! Jump, 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 jump! Okay. Okay. I think you passed the test. Uh oh. Sam is our winner, everyone! You came back and you redeemed yourself. How do you feel? I don't know. Feels good. <laughs> so, Lao Food Foundation is one of the partners of the Lao Food Festival. Uh, we are super proud of all of our partners here in San Diego. Our mission really is to preserve, promote, um, and 
celebrate the beauty of Lao food. The all recent... of our amazing contestants. So judges, I'm gonna have you all stand to the side for now. Just look pretty and amazing. Um, and also we have some of these for you all later too. Woo! Give them a round of applause. Yeah! Woo! Welcome, 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 welcome. We have a station right here. All right, my contestants. <laughs> Before you get started, I would like to know who you are. Now let so me let's... introduce everyone to our third contestant. Lem Santoy, Cambodian, Thai, and Laotian. So I speak all three. Who Thai die? Get come back on. Who Lao go die? Whoa! Maybe we should be calling you Mr. International. Ladies, what do you think? What are you seeing right now? Do, do they look like they have some time left? So three minutes it took you to make that papaya. Okay. Come on, come on, okay. You know, and um, would you say? Uh, All right. Okay. It was a really, really Thai, like really, really good. Um, officer, your boklahong is so delicious. Your papaya, very delicious. Oh, I love. I felt the love and what you meant. You made it with love. And wow, you dressed it really good. Oh, spicy. When it comes down to it, the winner of the first papaya contest of the year winner, number one. What we made is because it was spicy and we taste the padak. Um, in Lao, we say, uh, It was so delicious, so savory. And the second winner with the tanginess, so well balanced. And the officer, please don't arrest me because it was so good too. Akun, brother, thank you. Give it up for the winner!